It's slick, sleek and smooth. It's also fast, maybe fast enough to help save the planet. This is Forest Bot, a third generation tree planting machine that sprung from the imagination of inventor Marcelo Guimarães, who believes that only technology can effectively mitigate global warming. Chegou a hora da gente se mobilizar. The time has come for us to mobilize and elevate this to a global scale. We need machines planting forests across the whole world. If we do that, we will solve the problem of global warming. Trees are the solution. We need machines that will plant trees. Guimarães started by planting African mahogany, a highly lucrative hardwood. While innovating germination and greenhouse techniques, Guimarães says he planted nearly 2 million trees on 2,000 hectares using his first and second generation machines. Then he realized that he could earn more by planting several native tree species and even crops along with the mahogany. A variety of trees would resemble a forest and resist disease and insects better. But to make that work, he and his brother Eduardo needed to go full on high tech. To get there, we combined a number of existing technologies, soil analysis technologies, GPS for monitoring and artificial intelligence to ensure that each tree is planted properly. All of these functions are easy for a human to do, but not for a machine. Each tree is geolocated for monitoring purposes. Satellite imagery tracks individual tree growth and the overall increase in the wood biomass of each planted hectare theoretically capable of planting up to 3,600 trees per hour, the brothers say theirs is the fastest, most reliable tree planter in the world. But they have even bigger plans. According to conservationists, one trillion trees need to be planted to mitigate climate change. But so far, only a future version of this machine seems to be attracting interest from investment funds and venture capital for large-scale production. ForestBot is a tech startup. The company has designed a fourth-generation autonomous planting machine to be built with the funding from a major Brazilian investor. Guimarães claims it will be capable of navigating and reliably planting in the harsh terrain of burned or deforested areas. He predicts real and meaningful reforestation will begin to happen within the next decade. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN, Boa Vista, Brazil.